Hello Leos. Welcome to Visions of Light and Love. This is your reading for the month of September. This reading is for all of the Leos out there, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. If the reading does not resonate with your situation, check out the new Venus and Rising Sign videos. Cross watchers are welcome as well. If you like my energy, my vibe, you connect with this reading and you feel like I am the reader for you and you want to show some support, hit the subscription link along with the notification bell, the thumbs up image to help the video circulate. And if you need a personal private reading, the link to the email address is in the description box. Stay till the end for updates and further news. Okay. Other little goodies. Again, this reading is for the Leos, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Cross watchers are welcome as well. All right. I'm using a Celtic cross spread for this reading. So let's get started with your current energy. What is the current energy? Not, oh. <clears throat> four of, you have the four of cups. Four of cups. Why is this four of cups here? Yeah, this is you, queen of wands. Mm -hmm. What's the past energy? Five of Pentacles. Why is this five? Oh, what? Leo. Okay, you have the Ace of Pentacles. Your overall energy is the Star card. Some of you could be dealing with an Aquarius, or you have Aquarius in your chart. In your immediate future, you have the Hangman. Pisces energy you could be dealing with the Pisces. We have. You fear the Knight of Cups in the reverse. <clears throat> this is your energy or your partner's. Ap or apply this energy as it fits to your story. All right. So we have the Seven of Swords in the reverse. You're hoping for the world card and your outcome is the Page of Cups, okay? All right, at the bottom of the deck, Two of Wands. This is you, Leo, having a decision to make. Having a decision to make, but I feel like there is a decision on the table that's being ignored by you or your partner. There's a decision on the table that's being ignored by you. That's what it looks like. I feel like in the past, someone walked away from this union, walked away from having a new beginning. Could, could possibly work with this person. But someone walked away. Excuse me. From a new beginning. Could have been an Aquarius with the star card. This is what's on your mind at this time. Healing, hoping that things get better. Something is causing you to feel vulnerable. I feel like in the immediate future with the hangman. Things are stuck suspended in the air. And that's how, they want, how they're going to remain. Stuck and suspended in the air. Some of you could be losing money or lost some money or something like that. Like, I'm I'm seeing loss. Like, you fear that you're not going to be able to go towards this person. You fear that you're not going to be able to turn your back on them and walk away. You're hoping that you can go towards them. Um, travel towards this person because I'm seeing emotional and physical distance. You two may live in two different cities, two different states. 
two different countries. I'm just seeing a distance here. This could be a long distance relationship. I am seeing, um, could be a fixed sign, um, another Leo, Scorpio, Taurus, or an Aquarius that you are dealing with. But I'm seeing you, you may be reaching out to this person, offering them, a, sending them a message, let, letting them know how you feel or expressing how you feel. Or this is them sending you this message. So let's see what else. Why is there five of pentacles here? Okay. Trying to, I hear, it seems like I hear my dog, but I don't see. Oh, I see him. <laughs> Thought he was my flippers. Okay, I'm sorry. So, I'm seeing with the six of wands, you may be getting attention from other people, or you're trying to get this person's attention. Yeah. I feel like with this nine of pentacles and a reverse, you're trying to get this person's attention, but you feel like you're um you're you're tired of feeling like you're in this by yourself. Like you may also feel like this person is getting attention from other people. Yeah. And it's causing some type of um, feelings of regret, um, disappointment, remorse. Because you want to take action to go towards this person. You, you want to overcome these obstacles with this person. You want to have an honest conversation and start over. But I feel like you're not saying anything. Like, there, I'm seeing a lack of communication. Why is this Ace of Pentacles here? Oh. Okay, so someone has options. Someone has options. And we're not... This person... Someone wasn't able to balance things out in this union. There is a lack of balance. Because there were too many, pe too many other people in this situation and that's what caused someone to walk away because someone was juggling giving to multiple people yeah and now someone is overthinking overthinking and wondering if their partner is dealing is in a committed relationship or dealing with someone else and it's causing some type of internal conflict. This waiting period is causing conflict in this union. Or within the mind of someone's mind. <laughs> so things will be stuck suspended in the air if nobody is able to communicate. And I'm seeing with the high priestess and reverse cancer Pisces energy. Someone is not listening to their intuition. Not at all could be a Cancer or a Pisces. Someone's not listening to their intuition. They're going about on their way, just doing anything. Could be juggling multiple people, multiple things. And we have the four wands, so there could also be a marriage here. Why is this four wands here? Yeah, okay. So someone is in a relationship, a committed relationship. And that's why this person walked away and stopped work, stopped putting in his work in this union. Yeah, the lover. See, someone had some. There, there was another. This, this was a third party. <clears throat> there was someone in um a secret. Initials could be a J or a B, but someone had some secrets. And I feel like with this emperor, they tried to control the situation for as long as they could, but they can't control it anymore. Why is this emperor here? Yeah. Tried to control the situation. 
So someone with the King of Cups coming out in the reverse. The Knight of Cups came out. You are afraid that you're not going to be able to move towards this person anymore. Nurture the situation with them. You fear that this person is losing um, emotion. Losing emotions for you. Lose the love, like the love is lost. You don't want them to walk away. You don't want them to block you and to restrict you from communicate, communicating or seeing them. Yeah, because you want a second chance. But something has to come to an end in order for a new beginning to come in. In order for you to be able to... You have to put something to an end. With their sun part and their death part. That's your energy. In order to have this two of cups. This give and take reciprocity. What's the outcome? <clears throat> yeah. So there was, in the outcome, I see a tower moment. Mm. <laughs> I don't know why these cards are coming out this way. All right, let me shuffle these again. Sometimes you just gotta, the cards just be like, it's the energy. Some some of you are all over the place, or your partner is, whomever it is that, that you think about when you hear this reading. Someone is all over the place. Why is that tower card there? So the foundation of this union came crumbling down because someone was breadcrumbing the other person. And with this four of swords here, someone is up at night thinking about this. Someone's going to be up at night trying to figure out how they can balance things out. How they can balance things out. with in a home or with someone that they feel like they're at home with any more messages yeah someone's moving on this is toxicity someone is quickly moving on this from a toxic situation could be a cancer yeah because someone Someone had a broken heart over a third party. So I'm not even going to pull any more cards because it's saying the same thing over and over again at this point. There was a third party. Someone walked away because someone had options. Caused a broken heart. Made them look like a fool. So this person stopped putting the work in here in, this, in the situation. So let's see, Leo, let's see what um, your partner... What else is on your partner's mind? What else is on Leo's partner mind? Mm, okay. Your partner has something to say. <laughs> okay. So your partner compares others to you. They compare. They trusted you. This person is saying they trusted you. But someone is in a committed relationship. And they are saying, I admire. This person admires the person that you are. I miss being with you. They do miss being with you. They still find you attractive. Patiently waiting. This Someone may be having problems with intimacy. Remember, these energies could be vice versa. They feel so happy when they're with you. But you broke their heart. And that's why they can't be with you. Okay. This is why this person can't be with you. They, they have a broken heart. Let's see. Oh. Someone was wearing a mask in this situation. Not really um, telling the other person how they really felt. 
Why is this mess card here? Yeah. Someone was wearing a mask. Definitely, like, not telling the truth. Someone was not telling the other person how they really felt. Not letting the other person know, like, you compliment me. Someone needs to grow up because that's why this person is not, like, opening back up. Because I'm seeing that someone needs to grow up and take that mask off. Okay, so there, there's something changes. Someone may be coming back in for um to revisit this. Yeah. Someone may be coming back in, but be careful with the keys on the ring. This person may be coming back in to um have a one night stand or to have sex or something. But I'm gonna leave it at that. Leo's, this is your reading for September. Comment below. Let me know if this is your story. Share, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, be safe. I'm sending you love, light, peace, and healing energy. Oh, don't forget. Oh, I didn't say anything. But if you would like to be considered for a free reading, you must be a subscriber. Like this video. Comment below, leave me your email address. Don't forget to make sure your notifications are on. I often do these free readings, and um, when I reach back out to people, they're not responding back because your notifications have to be on. So enjoy the rest of your week, and I will see you next time. Bye.